How Do You Know It's Summer? Written by Ruth Owen. It's summer. There are four seasons in every year. Spring, summer, fall, and winter. Summer is the season when many people have fun at the beach on hot, sunny days. Gardens are filled with colorful flowers. Busy insects seem to be everywhere. Look for these and other signs of summer as spring comes to an end each year. Each year, summer starts on either June 20th or June 21st. The first day of summer is marked on calendars. The longest day is here. As summer gets closer, there are more hours of light each day. Sometimes it is even still light outside at bedtime. The first day of summer is the longest day of the year. This means there are many more hours of light than darkness on that day. Once summer arrives and the longest day has passed, there are fewer hours of daylight each day. It's heating up. Hot weather is often a sign that summer has arrived. It may even feel hot outside at night. In some places, it may not rain for days or weeks during the summer. In some places, summer is the time for thunderstorms. People may see lightning flashes and hear the rumble of thunder. Summer Colors Many plants grow colorful flowers in summertime. Butterflies and bees often go from flower to flower to find food. They are looking for the sweet liquid that flowers make. It is called nectar. Plants make seeds inside their flowers. The seeds drop from the flowers in late summer and fall. In spring, the seeds will grow into new plants. Green Leaves In spring, fat green buds grow on the branches of some trees. The buds burst open into flowers and leaves. By summer, however, the flowers have disappeared and the leaves cover the trees. There may be another clue that summer has arrived hidden among the leaves. Fruit. On apple trees, for example, tiny apples begin to appear during summer. The leaves of a tree make a shady spot where people and animals can cool off on a hot day. Time to leave home. Summer is the season when many young animals leave their mothers. Squirrels are born in spring. By the summer, they are old enough to live on their own. They will build themselves homes called drays from twigs and leaves. In summer, it is usually cooler in the early morning and evening than in the middle of the day. Many animals look for food at these times. They rest in the shade during the hottest parts of the day. Taking off. Many young birds learn to fly in summer. For example, a swallow chick begins to learn by standing on the edge of its nest. It flaps its little wings again and again, trying them out. Then it jumps. With its mother and father close by, the young swallow takes its first flying lesson. Birds like to splash in water to cool off in the summer. Tiny Signs of Summer in summer, you can see more insects than at any other time of year. Grasshoppers hop around on lawns, eating grass and other plants. Tiny aphids suck the juices from plants. Hungry ladybugs stay busy eating the aphids. Insects eat plants and other insects. In summer, it is easy for them to find lots of food. Summer in a Garden In summer, the seeds that people planted in spring have grown into plants. Giant sunflowers soar taller than a child. Juicy red tomatoes hang from tomato plants. Crunchy carrots grow under the soil. Summer is the season when gardens are filled with flowers and good things to eat. Summer lasts until September 22nd or 23rd. Then fall begins. The End this read aloud has been brought to you by Time to Read to Us. Hit the subscribe button for more kid friendly read alouds. Thanks for watching!